tonight. Family and friends came together to remember Kathleen Moore. Her body was found in the woods feet away from her boyfriend's home yesterday, and the Pasco County Sheriff's Office arrested that boyfriend for murder. Nico Clemens is at the vigil for more tonight. He joins us live with the latest. Nico. Hey, Josh, Jennifer, that vigil ended a couple hours ago, but the candles are still burning for Kathleen here. A very emotional atmosphere tonight. People gathered here on Carmel Avenue in front of Knapp's home. They hope her tragic murder sends a message. So we're going to find our answer through prayer. We're going to find our answer through the word of God. A family and a community are heartbroken. She do have an army still out here that's going to forever represent her from her co-workers to her friends and her family. Brittany Kendrick says everyone loved her cousin Kathleen Moore. And who wouldn't? She always had that smile. She always had jokes, always loved everyone. That's why this is so hard to know that she had to face someone like him on her own. The Pasco County Sheriff's Office arrested Colin Knapp for Moore's murder. They eventually found Moore's body in the woods, 50 yards from Knapp's home. <laughs> it's in front of that same home. People came together to light a candle in her name. Kendrick says Moore planned a balloon release for another cousin they already lost. It's not going to even feel right to have to add her to our balloon release. Moore and Knapp were in a relationship. Her family and friends hope others in a similar situation learn from the tragedy. Any women out there that's going through any the domestic, please get out of it. It's not love. It's not love. It's not worth your life. A life taken too soon. All they have now are memories. And I really hope her boyfriend gets the justice he deserves because he did not deserve to take someone's life. He doesn't play God. A couple dozen people came out tonight to show their respect. Uh, I talked with a woman. Uh, she came from Tampa, didn't know more at all, but again, just wanted to be here with the family and show them again honor and respect. No funeral arrangements right now for more, but of course, when we learn that information, we'll share it with you. Live in Newport, Richie, I'm Nico Clemens, 8 on your side.